So I'm currently behind the wheel of the 2021 BMW M3 competition. And like many BMW M models, this features your M buttons. And I wanted to take some time to showcase what I personally adjust my M button to be. So I personally just really use M1 uh, when I'm using these vehicles because I come from an E92 M3 where we only had one M button. So I'm gonna focus on just what my M mode button for M1 is. So going to configure M1, scroll to the top. So an engine, I like it in the most nutty setting at Sport Plus. You can switch it also between efficient and sport should you wish. Transmission, I like it in the most aggressive mode as well, but you can obviously switch it uh, between one and two. The chassis suspension, this one is probably I may adjust uh, depending on uh, you know if I'm gonna be going to the office more than likely on some bad roads. So this one might be the one M setting that actually gets adjusted the most during any sort of ownership or driving. But right now I like to leave it in the most nutty setting to experience the full potential of, of the M3. Steering is something that I'm probably one of the few that leave it in comfort versus sport. To me, a lot of the sport feeling steering wheels where it's a lot tighter, it's it's kind of like a steering or the vehicle pretending it doesn't know how to steer. Like it's all that technology to make it very comfortable for you. Um, making it really tight and some sort of feedback feeling, uh, you know, it's, it's too fake for me. I prefer just the comfort, normal spinning the steering wheel around as, as the technology allows. Brake I have in sport. This vehicle has the optional carbon ceramic brake package, so I like to utilize the brakes to their maximum potential, and I believe that to be in sport mode. DSC on. I, I've been driving this through some rainy days um, since I've had the vehicle. If I was driving on the track, I'd probably still have a MDM mode on, because that's what I do in my personal daily driver M3. The M traction control, um, it's currently off because it's only adjustable when you turn off uh, stability control. Auto start stop, I have it off because I don't want it turning on and off when I have it in the nuttiest modes because of the next step. The sound control, if this was on, it's basically going to burble and pop and awkwardly at red lights and I just, I don't want the auto start stop to, to kind of ruin that experience for me. But as the last option, I always have the sound control on because I really enjoy the burbles and pops of the exhaust in the BMW M3 competition. But those are the different options that I select in my uh, M1 button. Uh, I'd love to hear from you and what your options are or what you agree or don't agree. Or if you suggest I change a different option, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to chat with you. Thanks for watching.